Hey there, I'm Andrew Doyle and I am a teacher and campus minister at Aquinas High School and a liturgical musician for the Diocese of San Bernardino. I'm excited to talk to you today. It is Sunday, January 27th. We know truly that not each of us is alike. What I mean to say there is that I am better at some things than some of my friends and my friends are better at other things than I am. We know this. We see it in our workplaces, in our families, and in our communities. Where we can also understand it is in our church. Not everyone has the same skill set. Not everyone has the same talents and treasures or time. But what we do all have in common is our love and adoration of our God. We are all made in the image and likeness of our divine creator. We are all children of God. This means that we are brothers and sisters in Christ. Something simple, but very profound. As brothers and sisters, we make up the body of Christ here on earth. As the second reading reminds us, we are the many different body parts of Christ, the church here on earth. Some of us might be the blood. Or some of us might be the hands, some of us might be the skin, or the hair, or the knees. All of us are something unique and specific within this body. And if any one of us becomes injured, spiritually or physically, it affects the rest of the body, although sometimes in different ways. As such, we must be aware of the fact that we are one together. And as we hear in the Gospel, we must all be cloaked in the same spirit. If we are all making up the body of Christ here on earth, then we have an understanding that the Spirit of the Lord comes upon us as well, much the same way as it did in the Gospel we read today. We are the new body of Christ, and the Spirit of the Lord is upon Him. We are to bring glad tidings to the poor, liberty to captives, and let the oppressed go free. It falls to us to use each of our individual skills to keep the body of Christ alive, healthy, and well. Let us pray. Lord, we thank you for the blessings that you bestowed on us today. Let us never forget those blessings and all of the good things in our life. We ask you to help us recognize our place within the body of Christ. We ask all this in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Thank you for your encouragement to the team that brings this daily reflection every day to you. You can support us so that we can continue to bring this message daily. You can support us with your contributions and with your donations by calling the number on the screen or by visiting our website and clicking on Donate. Blessings always.